Hey guys, what's up? Fax here with the Game Coop. We're back playing even more ardent craft games here in front of his glorious seal of approval. I approve! And I'm ah. game. I approve of me right. being game. And you being X. So, and this being ardent craft. <laughs> so I died like four times. Previous episode. Well, but, you know. Oh my god, we got this thing so, in my inventory, this zombie head. So deep dark. Yeah, and that's going to become a farming station. So I'm going to make that happen. What's your plans for this episode? Um... I think I will summon the wither, but maybe um, at at the bottom of the world instead. Okay. And uh, it's actually sort of a good thing, because I don't think I've charged the mob grinder. I don't remember. No, I have not. So, I will snag this um, tile.blockcapbank.none.name. Okay. And take oh, it. Oh, how with ironic. Me. That was also the thing I was going to snag. Oh, okay. I mean, I can give it right back to you, actually. Because I think this guy keeps his, um... Maybe he keeps his power? Maybe he doesn't keep his power. We'll find out. Oh, that glorious slice and splice that you can't just shift-click things into anymore. Oh. Hey, look. Oh. Did he keep his power? This is mine now. Oh. Okay. Content saved. So, yes. It should have a bit of power. Oh, I got that Z-Logic controller. Oh, uh, yes. Oh, also, in here, there are a couple capacitors that I went mm -hmm. I went looting, and I swapped out one of them, this one. What's a loss capacitor? It's so a loss. Um, a lost capacitor is, by the power of Ender's Glow, I have good villainous premium planting enhanced hungry enhanced capacitor. Um, I think the breakdown, there's like, there's actually a pretty good thing if you Google it. Uh, of a breakdown of all those different things, but this is basically a spawner or um, a capacitor for a uh, the planting one. Help me out here. Premium. Wait, where did you find these? Uh, just in chests. I think I found, I went looking for a desert so we could get some cactus, which is why there's cactus out in the front yard. Um, and uh, I found a desert temple, and they were in the um, the four chests. Each one had a capacitor in it. That's weird. Yeah. What are you going to use these for? Um, they're just like, you see the attack capacitor that's in here? It's the one that was in the um, tag mill. I swapped it out to a heaven sent uh, good smelting something something something. Which is See, I have to uh, actually move it to the table so I can see what it says. Oh, there really? we go, heaven sent. An attached note described this as good smelting enhanced capacitor. Yes. Shouldn't that be in uh, the, the alloy smelter? You are probably correct. And I probably put it into the sag mill because I mistook it for the smelter. <laughs> Class. <laughs> ah, I got him. Yeah. All right, I'll swap them out. Sweet. But, like, there's a nice crafty capacitor dud. So, like, that one probably doesn't have a lot of power, but it's okay for speeding up the crafter, which I don't know if we'd ever use that ever. Yeah. But, you know. I mean, the crafter's kind of neat. Yeah. I'll probably actually end up incorporating one of those to convert essences to essences. Um, but you should use an RF tools crafter maybe though, as opposed to like a. Oh, is that not the? Oh, is there's that... an Ender IO one as well. Yeah, but yeah, I can gotcha. Pretty much never use it. Now, do you want to be? Do you want to part? Be party to this reckless behavior, or uh, would you like to? Maybe. Um, <laughs> possibly. <laughs> I may actually work in the background here and work on a farming station and enchanting. Because enchanting is a good idea. I do have. This enchantment table, a lot. and this yeah. enchanter, and this dark steel anvil. So we have we have some things in place to begin doing these things. Farming station. Dum, 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 dum. Actually, I think I'm gonna just go. Um... I actually read that as farm a loss. It said farm a lot. There's oh. a quest complete apparently. Oh, great. I, I don't know what it is. Get thirty levels. I'm about to enchant my pants. Randomly, fire protection? Really? No. I s slash refuse. <laughs> Never mind. My helmet? I mean, I don't need fire protection and fire immune pants. Okay, nice. Protection four, unbreaking three, and soulbound. I don't really need unbreaking, but hey, I'll take that soulbound and I'll take um. Wait, how did protection you? Four. Wait, what are you enchanting? My hat. Oh, okay. Just the old-fashioned way. Gotcha. Slightly old-fashioned way, with the mana pylons instead. Yeah, hell yeah. Good times. 
Oh yeah, that protection three though, that's the difference, or protection four, man, right there, I can feel it, ugh, so good. Can you feel it? I can feel it. What do we need for, um, where's regular recipes, where's it? recipe, recipe, no, you don't show me recipes anymore, enchanter? I could have sworn the enchanter had a section that- Potential transceivers are complicated to make. That sounds- I probably will. Oh, what are you trying to do, transfer power? Oh, actually, no. I kind of want to do um, immersive engineering. Just Good. a little bit of looks. Um, I was actually going to suggest Draconic Evolution, because you can do the lower ones relatively easily. The lower tier guys. Wait, what is it? Draconic Evolution has a power transfer system. It's wireless. It just uses laser beams, which do shoot through the house and stuff. But it transfers a ridiculous amount of power, even on the lower tiers. It just doesn't have a tremendous range, and it's What's the name of the item? slightly expensive. Um, it is Looking at Draconic. I'm not seeing the anything. wireless energy crystals, um, or energy relays, or I/O crystals. They they're all sort of the same thing. You make the the energy relays. I think are the ones. So it's four diamonds in a energy core. Yeah. I'm not yes. seeing any of that stuff that you are. That guy, my god. Um, I'm not seeing any of this stuff that you are mentioning. Well, I can go ahead and make one real fast. How about that? We are talking Draconic Evolution, right? Si, mucho gusto. Okay, because I put uh, at Draconic and I'm not seeing anything. Um, they're, they're the little blue, purple, and um, orange uh, gemstones. They're very small icons. Oh, okay, I see it. Yeah. So I just made four basic energy relay crystals. Let's see if we can upgrade them. Mm, that's slightly expensive to upgrade. But we can split this guy in half. And we now have energy IO. Um, I want to do it. Okay. Her, her friend. <laughs> you can have these three. And you All can right, have so what is... these. All right. This one. We're gonna want a crystal a laser beam, huh? crystal binder. Actually, I'll make one of those too. Yeah. So go is ahead. It and... The wrench thing. Yeah. I, I can do it. Cool. Um, actually, I'll I'll go ahead and put the capacitor bank back to. Let me. Oh, we don't actually have a free space left. That's okay. That's okay because we're about to have something. Go ahead and slap like and on the just like just like plop them on the front. On yeah. Excellent. And um, if you mouse over it, you can see there's an I.O. mode. It's on balance. If you right-click that, you can change it to input, output, or balance by default. By default, balance means it'll draw power into itself and try to balance with anything it's attached to that's also in balance. Um, what that means okay. is it's draining the shizzle-wizzle out of our, well, 481 RF a tick, I guess, 480 RF a tick, um, to store up 4 million RF so it will slowly but surely eat all of our power just to have it in the energy IO crystal. So typically what I mean, what I suggest to do is have senders and receivers, unless you want a large power storage. Um, and so this guy would be set to input because it inputs energy into an energy system. And then you'd have an output connected to that that would output energy to whatever it's connected to. If I'm not mistaken. I just gotta fiddle with it. Aw, yeah! Alright, so how would I... How do I change the mode? Um, just right-click with an empty hand, I believe. Okay, apparently not with a shield. Nope, that opens up an IO. Or a UI, sorry. Boop. Oh, okay, shift right-click? Shift right-click. Yep, okay, so we want to do output on this one. So it will pull power, and it'll shoot it through this relay, and the relay will get this one, and you have it be... Ooh, I like this. I like this for power. Okay. I, ca I can do this. Actually, I think this is backwards. I think that one needs to be input and this one needs to be output. Because, like, this this is an energy transfer and containment system. Okay. So if this guy is input, it puts power from whatever it's connected to into the power storage that itself has. Oh, okay. Okay, okay. I think I got it. You can also, if we wanted, actually, I suppose we could take that out and put it on balance, and then it would act as a capacitor as well. But uh, I mean, should balance. Yeah, but like we could take the capacitor totally out of there if we if we wanted. But but anyway, it's fine. Whichever whichever we prefer. 
Da da da! And now, we do we have do we have an uh, indestructible matok? Yeah, I got one. Sweet. I'm all over it. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Yeah, this is real nasty. I'm enjoying this. All right. Oh, wait. You put this. You put an octatic in here. We should put the. We should put the crafty one of, um, digging plant. Of whatever it does. Plantiness. Premium planting enhanced hungry. <laughs> <laughs> sure, <laughs> that thing that you said. Well, because I mean, it's not we're gonna use it for anything else, you know. Yeah. And now we have a spare um, octatic for something. Oh, here it is. Now oh, we're storing it in there for some reason. Man, draconic evolution, fun times. I'm actually gonna slap that there to neat. to charge up for a little while. Oh, we are gonna shift all these upgrades to this thing now. Oh, yeah. Oh. Yeah, boy! How long has it been since we extra power sheared? It's been a ages. minute. Just absolute ages. I wonder how fast a chunk of charcoal is used in this thing now. Let's find out. A chunk of charcoal? A cube of Just charcoal? Just one, one piece of charcoal. A single piece? And gone. Yep. Mm. So less than a second. My god. It's because the relays hold 4 million, don't they? They do. Well... Each one, I think, holds 4 million. So the IO crystal over here is 4 million. This guy is 4 million. And then the the output one is 4 million. And since they're balancing, they'll all try to keep, like, 2 million. Well, I mean, that's not true. They'll, they'll balance between all of them. So they'll all go up to 4 million. It'll just take a minute. All I'm hearing is I need to put more power. Yeah. Get more power. I mean, more power sounds great. I love power. Power's wonderful. We'll just be chopping trees forever offline. Offline? Off camera? That's the one. Which but, uh, tool is it that controls the harvesting? Oh, this thing doesn't have any power for some reason. That's weird. Well, here, just set this guy to... Oh, you're sure right, the shield. Shield ruins everything. Whoa! It just chopped down our trees! It ruined yep. everything. It ruined everything. <laughs> Look at this. At Look house. at this. The painting. <laughs> the painting. <laughs> all right, all right. That's fine. We can fix it. <laughs> my God, Wait, the so range. How... It's because oh it's because it's the uh, the thing. Uh, we'll we'll switch to bricks over here. How about that? Sure. And my question is, why did it even do that? I had that in the host slot. Uh, well, it's it's a the trees are harvestable, right? Well, yeah, but I sw I had the axe in the host slot, so it had, didn't have an axe in it. Well, I think it still treats it as an axe. It's a multi-purpose tool, okay. and it doesn't actually matter what slot you put things in. I don't think so. It was just like sure, all what's, this stuff. What's the range on this? So I just put a regular old. Actually, wait. Hang on. Ender IO capacitor. Look at this! Look at this! Look! It planted it over here. Get out of there. <laughs> Get out of there. Ah, uh, Good. Good. Oh my. I forgot to check which capacitor I need. So I actually need... Oh. None. Actually no. Double layer is 11 by 11. Yeah, so that would be the full room. So that double layer would be the full room, but not the walls. Mm-hmm. Okay, so I'm gonna get that... That special one out of there. Oh, I know, right? I mean, but it's fine. It's it was clearly an issue. Double rear capacitor. Boop. Hey, two of these things. Rand, I think I'm gonna go um summon and destroy a wither, or maybe maybe right. we'll wait for next time for that. Maybe we'll yeah. tease it, just. So Just many times, like, look, look, look at the, look at the, what I'm doing in my inventory right now. I mean, you can't see what I'm doing in my inventory, but the studio audience, the audience can, see can see it. I just summoned a wither in my inventory. Oh my gosh. Wait, what? Yeah. What? So good. Like, it's happening right now, but I got a mob grinder right here. So, like, as soon as he summons in my inventory, it's, it's just, it's over. It's over. In your inventory? <laughs> Oh wait. oh wait! Oh, you're just drawing the thing in your inventory. <laughs> yeah. All right. All it's right. like, look, this, this mod pack, and who knows what's actually happening. I was about here. to say, like, are you literally summoning mobs in your inventory? Because it wouldn't surprise me. 
Yeah. I mean, I'll get right on that. Is this thing harvesting? Where's my watering dongle? There it is. What is that noise? I'm trying to... Oh, you're trying to get the seal. <laughs> Look, man. It's oh, wait. really important. Where are you though? planting it at? You have to hit... Uh, you have to put it on this one to trigger a 4x4. That one? Yeah, that one. Okay. Yeah. Good luck. Thanks, friend. But until next time. Ah, 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 ah.